find sp 51 if cp is rupees 700 and loss is 10 percent second one if cp is rupees 300 and loss is 15 percent sp means selling price cp means cost price first one if cp is rupees 700 and loss is 10 percent write the given values cp is equal to rupees 700 Loss is equal to 10 percent. We have to find the SP. When cost price and loss percent are given, we can find the selling price using the formula SP is equal to CP into 100 minus loss percent by 100. Substitute the given values in this formula to find SP. That is equal to 700 into 100 minus 10 by 100. We have to simplify it using board math rule. First, we have to simplify the part of the expression within the bracket. 100 minus 10 is 90. So we can write this as 700 into 90 by 100. Let us simplify this in the rough work. Common factor of 700 and 100 is 100. Divide both of them with common factor. When we divide 700 with 100, we get 7. When we divide 100 with 100, we get 1. The values left are 7 into 90 by 1, which is equal to 630. So selling price is equal to rupees six hundred and thirty. Next one, if CP is rupees three hundred and loss is fifteen percent, write the given values. CP is equal to rupees three hundred, loss is equal to fifteen percent. We have to find the selling price. When cost price and loss percent are given, we can find the selling price using the formula SP is equal to CP into 100 minus loss percent by 100. Substitute the given values in this formula to find selling price. That is equal to 300 into 100. Minus 15 by 100. We have to simplify this expression using board math rule. First, we have to simplify the part of the expression within the bracket. 100 minus 15 is 85. So we can write this as 300 into 85 by 100. Let us simplify this in the rough work. Common factor. Of 300 and 100 is 100. Divide both of them with common factor. When we divide 300 with 100, we get 3. When we divide 100 with 100, we get 1. The values left are 3 into 85 by 1, which is equal to 255. So selling price is equal to rupees 255.